You've had classic pineapple Dole Whip. You might have even had some of the other flavors, but there are even more secret flavors out there you might be missing out on. I went on a hunt for some of the most unique secret flavors that you can try on your next trip. First off is a mango Dole Whip. I mean, mango Dole Whip, what a world we live in. Now you can find this treat at Hollywood Studios, but only for a limited time. So I'm really hoping that we can still get it. Also, um, it just started raining <laughs> and I have a lot of other fun treats planned out, but I'm really hoping the rain does not totally derail my plans. <laughs> All right, it is officially raining, but I've got this amazing little bit of sunshine right here. So I'm gonna have some tea. Mm. That is so good. This is actually the first year that there is a national Dole Whip Day. This little guy got his own day. So when I come to Disney, I have my tried and true favorites, the things I have to get every time. But then I also have this tension because I also love trying new things. So it's like, do I go with the classics or do I experiment with some new things? Maybe you can relate to that. Good news is that there's always fun treats to try at Disney World. If we're talking Dole Whip specifically, Magic Kingdom is my go-to for that. The Sunshine Tree Terrace in Aloha Isle always serve Dole Whip, and so on top of the traditional flavors, they often have special Dole Whip treats as well. Even other places in Magic Kingdom lately have been getting in the fun too, with Fantasyland and Storybook Treats often offering their own unique Dole Whip treats as well. Actually, come to think of it, Hollywood Studios is the only park that doesn't consistently serve Dole Whip. The other three parks always have some place where you can get the classic pineapple treat. I'll show you where all those locations are in just a minute. That Dole Whip treat was absolutely incredible and I'm kind of low-key sad that it's going to be gone soon. The mango, this is so good. But I want to kind of up the challenge and find a Dole Whip treat that's not citrus flavored. Or wait, is mango citrus? Okay, it's not tropical flavored. I think I might have found one that meets that criteria. So I think there's a flavor here, but I don't actually know exactly where it is. So while I'm looking for it, apart from Dole Whip getting a national holiday, it's also heading into its 40th anniversary. This iconic treat first debuted at Disney in the mid 80s. I was like, I found 1984, 1986. Couldn't see anything too definite. What does that mean? Dole Whip was already a sponsor of the park starting in the 70s, but they had like literal pineapple and pineapple juice that they were serving. So then they upgraded it in the mid 80s to the classic pineapple soft serve that we love today. Don't know if I'm going in the right direction, totally honestly. <laughs> Man, this resort is big, but this is such a unique Dole Whip flavor, I'm determined to find it. But getting back to Dole Whip, the parks have a lot to offer when it comes to Dole Whips. Here is everywhere you can get a Dole Whip in a theme park, but they are not the only ones serving up some tasty Dole Whip treats. Not in there, not over there. I've been looking for the backstretch bar, as in the backstretch of the golf course here. Oh yeah, it's all coming together. A lot of the resorts can have some specialty flavors too. Like if you're staying here at Saratoga Springs, you got this cherry blossom vanilla swirl option. But I'm so used to the classic flavors that I don't know how I'm gonna feel about this one. Mmm. Mmm. It tastes like something. What does it taste like? It's just, it's sweet and nice and refreshing. Huh. This was the flavor for right now, but they have a rotation of seasonal flavors. A couple of the resorts have their own special version of Dole Whip, so check online and see if yours might be offering something unique. But if we're talking resorts and Dole Whip, there is one clear winner. The Polynesian. Getting a Dole Whip here with the Polynesian music and the vibe and the lobby smell. Mm, that lobby smell. Anybody else know what I'm talking about? It is just so iconic being here with some Dole Whip. Now this location is really special to me because this is where I always grab a Dole Whip with my mom. And I think part of the appeal of Dole Whip is the nostalgia. It's been around for several years now. I mean, almost 40 to be exact. So there's opportunity to make magical memories around this iconic treat. And that's what Disney really is all about is making those special memories with your loved ones. There's lots of fun places to grab some Dole Whip here with the pineapple and I being one of the most popular ones. Dole Whip is so popular at the Poly that they built this whole dedicated area just for Dole Whip. They've got your classic flavors, even limited time treats, and you can find it just outside off the lobby on the first floor. So the plan originally was to get some lime Dole Whip over at Pineapple and I, but then I learned about this watermelon Dole Whip. I didn't even know that this was an option. And so if we're talking secret flavors, I had to go with this one. You can even get alcoholic Dole Whip treats here at Trader Sam's both inside and outside. They have this spiky pineapple, which is classic pineapple Dole Whip, but with rum. 
Talk about elevating a Dole Whip treat. But it doesn't even stop at Trader Sam's. You can get more adult Dole Whip drinks over at the pool bar. They have a Dole Whip lime margarita. Even if you're not staying at the Poly, they have this whole separate entrance to the pool bar right here so you can still enjoy the tasty drinks as well. And that's where I found this cutie. I think I really like this one. Basically, if you're looking for Dole Whip without a park ticket, Polly's the place to go. As much as I like this, I'm kind of struggling a bit, and that's a bit of a problem because I saved the treat that I'm most excited about for the end. I think that's the best one yet. It's a key lime pie swirled with vanilla, and it's topped with graham cracker crumbles, so it's literally like a key lime pie in ice cream form. I think this one's the winner. It checks all of the boxes. It's iconic in its flavoring, it's unique and special, plus it's about as secret of a treat as you can find. While I still love the classic flavors, being open to something different led me on this adventure where I discovered a whole world of Dole Whip I didn't even know existed, and I might have even found a new favorite in the process. Having new experiences at Disney is a way to keep making memories that last well beyond Main Street, and one of the best ways to keep having new experiences is with special events at Disney. I break down what it's actually like to attend one here so that you can be prepared when you go.